Thank How's it going, Jackson? It's going well, thank you. Um, Jackson, we want a little introduction from you, uh, your name, the role you play, your mm -hmm. character's name, and what movie you're going to be on. Okay, uh, my name is Jackson Rathbone. I play Jasper Hale in Twilight Saga Breaking Dawn Part 2. Jackson, what can we expect from this new movie? Well, here in uh, Breaking Dawn Part 2, uh, you know, for fans of the series that have been with us over the years, they know exactly what to expect. Uh, but for people kind of coming into it, it's uh, we start Breaking Dawn Part 2 with Bella's rebirth as a vampire, and she comes to life. and. It's something people have been waiting for for a year now uh, since the last movie came out. And she wakes up with the thirst, with the intensity of vision, and with the speed of a vampire. It's an exciting new world for her. Is this movie more adventurous than the rest? I would say Breaking Down Part 2 is the most exciting of the entire series. Uh, we really are closing out this film franchise with a bang at this last movie. And uh, I think the fans are going are gonna to really get something to sink their teeth into. <laughs> What was the most challenging thing for you as an actor playing your character? Uh, well, over the course of the years playing Jasper, it's been, uh, it's, it's been a lot of fun, you know, getting a chance to really kind of develop him from, from Twilight all the way to Breaking Dawn. And you know, it, it was, I think the most challenge was the, the physical aspects of, of playing this character. And that, I mean, the makeup. Uh, there was a lot of white yeah. makeup, man. It's like getting, getting painted white every day. Is, uh, it's, it takes a toll on your skin. And, uh, and the contacts are hard and, and difficult. But it, it, was, it was really fun getting a chance to you know, play a vampire. I, I enjoyed it. Tell me about your stunts. There's a lot of stunts in, these, uh, in this last film. Um, it's funny, I was actually talking about it earlier, and I did all of my stunts in this movie with a broken rib. I actually, uh, the, about a week before uh, we were filming some of the action sequences, I just, it's that stupid chance, I, uh, I fell, I, I cracked my rib, and uh, I didn't tell any of the producers about it because I wanted to do my own stunts for this film. And, and so I, I, I wore a rib splint, and I went in there, and I, uh, I, I did my scenes. And so there's a lot of pain in my face, you can see, that's, uh, that's real. <laughs> how, uh, how long are your shifts while shooting? Uh, we shoot anywhere from uh, you know, 12 hours to 15, 16 hours a day. So it's, it's, it's a long shoot, you know. It's, uh, sometimes those days you're just, uh, you're sitting in the, in the makeup for for what seems like hours and with those contacts in your eyes and you kind of get a little slap happy occasionally. How's the environment working with the other cast members? It's been it's been a wonderful journey through the years with uh, with the wonderful cast you know we kind of grew up together over the course of these last five years and I'm getting to see my castmates go on to do wonderful things and uh, I'm very supportive and, and you know they, we're very much like a family in a lot of ways. Now I know uh, Jasper's a little a little bit shy and I know you're into music and production and you've done sports and you know you seem like a very outgoing guy so how are you different from Jasper or alike? You know uh, there's, there's just a lot of similarities and a lot of differences between uh, myself in real life and, and Jasper. I mean I'm a I'm definitely you know a lot more outgoing I would say than Jasper but uh, you know he's been there's this wonderful influence in, in, in terms of you know kind of studying your character. I always say with Jasper that uh, he was forged in war, he was born in death, and he was saved by love. And I, I really love that about him. I think he's, a, he's an intense character, and uh, it, was a, it was a lot of fun to getting a chance to really develop him over the years. Are you going to miss playing Jasper? I'll miss him to a certain extent, you know. It's, uh, it's been wonderful. I've never imagined playing a character for this many years. Uh, in, in, in terms of film, you don't really get a chance to do that uh, very often. These kind of opportunities come around once in a lifetime, and it's been, it's been an amazing experience. Uh, sometimes in television, you know, you'll, you'll have a show that'll last for, for a long time, but it's, uh, it's still a rarity. Yeah, uh, that was actually my, my next question is, when you got casted for the first movie, what made you decide that, you know, you were going to be given your whole life to this movie for at least five years? Uh, it was, you know, it was uh, an interesting decision to make whenever, you know, someone offers you a job. You know, at first off, as an actor, it's, uh, it's always great to get a, get a chance to, you know, play something that you've never played before. And getting a chance to play a vampire just seemed like a whole lot of fun. And then, honestly, when we look back at Twilight, we were making a movie that we didn't know we were going to make the sequels. We, we, were, we had hopes, but we didn't know that people were going to come out and, and, and flock to the theaters and actually, you know, really kind of put that this little Twilight movie that could on the map, you know? Uh, to be sitting here five years later and with this, this franchise being as successful as it's been, it's, uh, it's been such, <laughs> such a kind of a trip, really. Uh, is it different playing for a movie than a TV series or a show? Or, you know, what, what's your intake on the industry? 
Well, whenever I first started off acting uh, professionally, I was 17. I was doing actually Shakespeare. <laughs> Um, so I was doing stage still, and then I moved out to Los Angeles, um, and I started working in, uh, in television, doing a little bit of film here and there, and it's, it's an interesting journey that, you know, the transitions from stage to, to television to film, it's all subtly different in, in terms of uh, how you approach each role and how you play the roles. Um, this business, it's, uh, it's a difficult business, and it's so saturated with so many actors that uh, it's tough to make a name for yourself, but, you know, I've... Uh, I really try to differentiate myself by my different pursuits in the arts. Uh, I have a production company. I've been producing films for the last few years. Um, I produced a web series alongside Warner Brothers, which was Facebook's first web series that they've done, um, as well as I have a music career. I'm just actually releasing my uh, first solo record uh, in December, and I have my first solo single that's out and available right now. It's called Billy Badass. It's, uh, it's out on uh, iTunes, or you can download it from my website, jacksonrathbone.com, for free. So. Now, very quickly, what can you tell your Latino fans out there? Can you say something in Spanish? Oh, man. Uh, te amo. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, gracias. Uh, my, my accent is atrocious, sorry. Um, but, uh, you know, it's, uh, they're so, so wonderful, and uh, they've been so amazing to me and uh, all of us in the Twilight series. And, you know, I just want to say thank you. Well, thank you so much. Hey, I appreciate it, man. Cheers.